You and I both know Nintendo Switch has a ton of sales. Like, it feels like they're almost always running some promotion. But I'm telling you, after scrolling through 25 full pages of great games, this blockbuster sale that they just started is quite possibly the best one ever. What's going on, everybody? It's Zach from Switch Force. I've cherry picked 20 games for you here. Uh, 25, actually, man. <laughs> it just goes on and on. But there's so many, so make sure to check the eShop for yourself. I'm going to give you some highlights. This sale runs until September 26th. So you've got almost two weeks to take advantage and let's just kick it off right away with neon white neon white is one of the best games of the year it is an indie card based shooter speed runner it's just phenomenal you got to give it a chance 20 dollars 20 percent off lowest price ever this game is quite literally a 9.5 or 10 out of 10. it is amazing and i think it'll be up for quite a few awards at the end of the year it's it's just that good and if you like any of these extra much and want to let other people know comment and if you see any others on the eShop that i should have pointed out that i missed comment and tell me where i goofed up but i'm going to take us next to death's door i love death's door now i love tunic the game just announced at the nintendo direct it's like a top-down zelda death's door is more combat heavy, I would say, and less explorative, but at $12.99, 35% off, it's a must play. Phenomenal game, you get to be a crow, and it has gorgeous graphics, it's still very Zelda-like, and it has just incredible visuals, and an incredible finish, and it's hard, but in a good way, it's it's just great. I love it so much. If you're looking for a different kind of hard, though, I got Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 1 Plus 2 for $20. That's half price for two games, and it's a great set of remastered remakes uh, that they brought back and you can feel like the old GBA days when I played Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 2 on my freaking Indigo Game Boy Advance. Now maybe you want to play Disco Elysium The Final Cut. That's $20, lowest price ever, 50% off. This game is regarded by some as the best PC game of all time and I've never played it. Shame on Zach, but I now have a chance to get it for half off. This is one where you are uh, it's sort of like a visual novel RPG hybrid with a lot of decision makings, building up your character um, and putting yourself in very precarious situations and seeing how things play out. Got a lot of love from the storytelling narrative department and also an interesting visual style. If you want something that's just weird, No More Heroes 3 is 50% off down to 30 bucks. Okay, this is coming out for other platforms later this fall. But the only place you can play it right now is on Nintendo Switch. So get after it. Best boss battles. Uh, I don't want to say in the industry, but some of the best. The, the, Suda knows what to do. It's just a crazy game. I, I think it's very antiquated in some ways, but the boss battles help it stand out. Now, what is also antiquated is uh, Sonic's Origins. Yet Sonic's Origins is the newest Sonic game, and it's its lowest price ever, 30% off, $27.99. That's the most recent collection of Sonic, and people liked it. So if you're already, you know, done with Sonic Mania, you're done with... Maybe you're done with Sonic for Tears before it even comes out, then you got Sonic Origins for $28. Bucks. Now, Sonic Colors is also on this list, lowest price ever. This is the Deluxe Edition for $27. Pretty darn good. That's really good price if you want to play... Uh, Maybe a better Sonic game than the one that's coming out. 40% uh, off. Maybe if maybe Frontiers is going to be fantastic, but it probably won't be as good as Bioshock 2 Remastered. $8, 60% off. That's a that's a hooper. All right, I love Bioshock. Everybody's kind of seen Bioshock. A lot of people have seen Bioshock Infinite. I think Bio 2 goes the most under the radar. Amazing. Some of the best power-up combos because you are the big daddy. Get those bees. Get those bees early. Use them often. Now, Star Wars Republic Commando is an older Star Wars title, I know. But for $7.50, this is a great tactical shooter and one that's really fun to have on the go and play with you uh, as we prep for the new Jedi game next year, Jedi Survivor. That one will not be on Switch, so get your Star Wars fill uh, with Republic Commando. Now, Heave Ho at 4 bucks is a phenomenal multiplayer fiesta this is one of those great multiplayer games that can be played with your competitive gaming friends as well as your grandma basically you can play this with anybody as you try to hold on and survive it's one of those like competitive co-op games where you can be a little sneaky but you're still trying to work together but there's definitely great laughs and a lot of yelling hooping hollering all the stuff that makes for a memorable evening if you want to do that solo though i recommend journey to the savage planet also 749 a popular price point today this is 75 percent off and this game is amazing when i think of my time with this game i think about crazy grapple swinging i think about awesome guns and i think about the creepy final boss battle this actually reminds me a lot of high on life if you've seen that game from the creators of rick and morty coming to xbox game pass this december journey to the savage planet has a lot of the same vibes 
Maybe it's a better game. I don't know yet, but it's fantastic. Just like Cuphead, 14 bucks, 30% off. I've been playing Cuphead again on the go because of the new DLC that came out a couple months ago. Man, that's such a good game. I, I, I put it down a while back when it first came out and I'm so glad I picked it back up. I actually started over. It's that darn good. I can't recommend Cuphead enough. This isn't the best sale it's ever had. Just it's one of the best games though. Ace Attorney Turnabout Collection. All right, this is the lowest price ever from Capcom. And, and just so you know, like all the typical suspects from Capcom and Ubisoft, all those are on sale. All the games you usually see on sale are on sale, but then there's so many more. And I think that's what makes this sale the best. It's like Blockbuster is going out of business, but you get first dibs at all their best VHS. Now the Ace Attorney Turnabout Collection is 35. Why so much? Well, because it includes both the great Ace Attorney Chronicles and Ace Attorney, Attorney Trilogy. So this is enough legal action forever. Buy this in your set for the rest of the year. You'll have enough really awesome storytelling with court cases uh, that, you know, are intense, but cool. It's just great. MLE The Show 22, 20 bucks, lowest price ever. That's 67% off, two thirds of the price chopped for Sony's only Nintendo Switch game. Now Metro Last Light Redux, five bucks, lowest price ever. This one's always on sale for like 10 or 750. Five dollars is the lowest it's been. And the original Metro 2033 is 250. So if you find some quarters, you can get a game that evolved into a pretty darn awesome franchise. Uh, we also have, let's look at this one right here, Kaze and the Wild Masks. No Donkey Kong at the Direct because they hate me. But Kaze is kind of like DK, except it was, I gotta be honest, like shout out to the indie devs that made this, but $30 was too much of an ask. Now it's $10, the lowest price ever, and that's phenomenal. I can wholeheartedly tell you go pick up Kaze and the Wild Masks for 10 bucks. It, it's kind of like a Donkey Kong type game and you get different masks and it's it's good. It's really good and no Donkey Kong this year, so play this instead. Machinarium, a classic. Me and my brother play this. It's one of those point and click adventures, but it's so evocative, immersive, and it's got such a nice art style. This is from the people that made Botanicula and that one game with the little black fuzzball, but Machinarium's 374 and it's just a really clever, cute, robot story with great puzzles. I, I can't recommend it enough. And other people can't recommend what remains of Edith Fitch enough. I beat this game. I don't remember how I felt after it. I think I really liked it. I don't know that I loved it, but it's $6. All the Annapurna stuff is also on sale, so you can peruse through that if you wish. I'm going to give you a good one, though. Ghost Runner is 12 bucks. Please get Ghost Runner. Please get Ghost Runner. Okay, $12. This game is phenomenal. I wish it was running a little better, but it's still phenomenal. It's normally $30. $12 for Ghost Runner. It is going to eat your fingers because it is demanding skill-wise, right? But it's got such a quick restart. That's like the best feature. You got a game like this where it's really hard and one shot, you're done. You need a great restart. Ghost Runner's got a great restart. Let's talk about Abzu. Eight bucks. Abzu is just a relaxing adventure. You need a weekend away from the kids. You need a weekend away from work. You need to just chill for a night on the potty. Abzu, eight bucks. Swim through the oceans and explore. It's it's really, really, really touching. Tales of Vesperia Definitive Edition. All right, they're bringing Tales of Symphonia to the Switch. Oddly, it runs at 30 FPS when freaking the GameCube version ran at 60. But anyhow, this is $8 for the Definitive Edition of Tales of Vesperia. I have a soft spot for Symphonia because I was a little kid, but uh, Vesperia is maybe a better game. 12 minutes is, is not $12, that would have been smart, but the lowest price ever is 15. This is a storyline with Willem Dafoe, Daisy Ridley, and somebody else. And I couldn't figure it out. It was too tough for me. I'm just gonna let you know that up front. It is sort of like a point and click adventure with big actors and a really intense storyline and some sort of time loop because your your life is only or the you know the storyline is only 12 minutes and you keep doing it over and over and over again. I didn't get very far. I didn't want to use a guide, but it feels like the kind of game that might require a guide. It's $15 down from $25. If you've considered it, it's definitely interesting. It's interesting and maybe worth a shot. It's something that I think you could enjoy, but you're going to have to, it's a brain burner. You're going to have to stick with it. Now, Grifflands is a game from Clay. I always recommend Mark of the Ninja. Uh, what's that one called? Little Light? No, um, Dark Light? Oh, gosh. The game with Wilson. He's all surviving. Oh my gosh. Don't starve. But this is Grifflands, 1339, lowest price. And uh, it's a card-based narrative game. I love cards. I don't know if you like cards, but I find cards to be fantastic. Now, I've given you a ton of titles today, 25 of them. Well, 24, because I haven't given you 23. These last two, Diablo 2 Re Resurrected. I know some people feel a type of way about Activision, but hey, it's 50% off, $20 for Diablo 2 Resurrected. And if the Diablo games play great on Switch, both of them. If you're done with three or want to start with this one, like they're great on the go experiences. 
and then what the golf what the heck are you doing not buying this game it's 11.99 40 percent off it's so fun it's so creative I, I love what the golf um it's basically golf but not golf this isn't like mario golf this isn't like golf story no 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 it's just like a cool puzzler with all sorts of wild antics and that's why it's called what the golf it's like wtf like what's actually going on here and what's going on is it's not actually a golf game okay you can see anyhow that's a phenomenal list and there's so much more so definitely get in there browse get your hands dirty all right i gotta tell you neon white is a phenomenal pickup at 20 bucks i gotta tell you that ghost runner is a phenomenal pickup at 12 dollars, and just about everything else i brought up just great death door at 13 disco elysium at 20 based on the reviews i mean this is a fantastic sale maybe one of the best ever let me know what you're targeting what you're picking up and if you have any other recommendations, thank you so much. I hope you got some value out of this video. I appreciate you guys. Make sure to stay safe, stay healthy, stay happy, stay positive out there. And until next time, thanks again. Switch Force. Out.